Okay, Mo, so a uh, quick video about the first four weeks of your program, phase one. Um, the objectives of this phase of your program is just to get you moving again, um, to just develop a bit of base base level of uh, strength and general fitness uh, that we can build on in subsequent phases of the program. So um, I've shared with you the folder. Um, within that folder in the Google Docs is uh, week one, week two, week three, and week four. So the structure of the program week uh, days one and three um, are purely strength and core strength um, focused. The days two and four of the program include some conditioning. Uh, it's important that you take a rest day after days two and four. Um, and I think we discussed that uh, last week that Monday, Tuesday would be good for training days. So you could do day one and two then. Um, resting Wednesday, Thursday, and then doing day three and four on Friday and Saturday, um, and with the rest day on the Sunday. Um, I think playing basketball, having a swim with the kids, um, doing all of that on the Sunday is fine. That's good active rest. Um, just a few notes on actually reading the program. So um, you may need to open up uh, phase one, week one, just so you can follow along with what I'm about to say. Um, you'll notice each day starts with a general warm up. Uh, the objectives of this warm up, um, as the name would suggest, is just to get you warm and sweaty. I don't want you working at 100% here, so you're going to be working at about 80%. Uh, it then dives into some uh, basic strength work. Um, each exercise before it's written A1, body weight squat, A2, A3. If you see the A1, A2, A3, it means that I want these exercises done in a superset. Okay, so what that means is you're doing it in a mini circuit. Um, so you'll do the first lot of the squats, the first lot of the uh, pull downs, and the first lot of the push ups, all in the one superset, um, or all in the one little circuit, and rotate through them. Okay. Also, there are some movements, say, on the dumbbell press or the pull-down where it says 1 plus 3 times 10. What this means is one warm-up plus three working sets of 10 repetitions. Okay, so each week the exercises are actually going to be remaining the same. There is slight increases in volume on certain things. So you'll notice the running intervals on day two, um, the distance increases slightly each week on those. Um, the squats, lunges, sit-ups, each week you're just adding a few reps to that and just building on that. Um, what I want you to do is to actually write down your notes in the in the Google Doc um, so that at the end of each week I can just sort of see how you've been going and at the end of the four week phase I've got a really good idea of how you've been progressing through the program. I've chosen exercises that you've done in the gym, um, so but I do understand that there might be some things that you don't remember. Um, so please feel free to drop me an email um, and I'd be more than happy um, yeah, to get back to you as soon as I see it and, um, and yeah, just to make sure that you're getting the most out of the program. Um, so I hope you're enjoying Hong Kong and yeah, good luck with the program. Like I said, any, um, any assistance that you may, may need, I'm um, here to help. All right, cheers, Mo. Bye.